Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and this is our daily inspiration card. If you want information about personal readings, they're in the description box. And I also have a live coming up on September 8th and on the 13th if you are watching this video before then. One is a spiritual hangout where we're going to be talking about current events. The other one is about Archangel Metatron, so check that out. All right, we have Ace of Raphael. All right, a positive new emotional experience, fulfilling romantic relationships, deep and lasting spiritual insights. Now, so many people are stuck in an ego loop, especially when it comes to our emotional fulfillment. We trap ourselves. We think that we have to become something other than what we are in order to be worthy of love. Or we think we have to give over and give in. Pretend we're okay with stuff that we're not in order to get validation. So what this card is talking about is definitely looking at where, where are you wanting, if you want real love and real love shows up and you reject it, what is that? and why or if you are keeping yourself from being happy i've seen it so many times where someone has to find the negative spin on everything now that is different than somebody who's actually going through some heavy stuff and they need to talk about it we don't want to go down the way of the covert narcissist or the narcissist in general who says your problems are not as severe as mine you know we don't want to do that to anybody but where do you stop yourself from receiving help perhaps or support or allowing ourselves to get excited about things because we've been disappointed so many times in the past. This is your chance to work with Raphael and heal that part of you, to heal that heart space. Now, I'm not going to sit here and say, you know, you do one meditation, you're healed, <laughs> be gone. It's all good now. <laughs> but, but this is, um, it's a constant self check-in. Okay. If I'm fearful, if I feel powerless, is that true? Is that really the case? Do I still need to give in to toxicity? Do I still need to let someone's viewpoint of me affect me? Work for no one's validation. And we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.